Contract negotiations between Pennsylvania's higher education system and faculty at Pennsylvania state-owned universities have been on the bargaining table for the past two years, and now talks of a strike are in the air. WENY Samantha Potter spoke with the faculty union rep and director of communications from the chancellor's office about what this means going forward. Samantha. Renata, after speaking with both representatives from the faculty union and the state, they could both agree affordable higher education to students is what's most important to both parties. But coming up with a financial solution on how to get there is the issue. We hope to get a fair contract. That's, that's what we want, a fair contract. Um, and uh, until we can get that, the possibility of a strike does loom. For Mansfield University spokesperson for the Association of Pennsylvania State College and University Faculties, Dr. Chuck Hoy, says going on a faculty strike is a card the union may have to play. Faculty and coaches at each of the 13 Pennsylvania state-owned schools have been working under an expired contract for more than 400 days. As the union and state system of higher ed try to work around continuous budget restrictions and making sure the faculty can provide students with a quality education. Ken Marshall from the state system of higher ed says over the past 10 years, more than 300 million have been cut from the system. We also have to take into account the fact that we are facing the most serious fiscal challenges in our history. Uh, our universities are operating today with the same level of state funding as they got in 1999. Both parties agree the biggest issues on the table include health care and redistribution workload for temporary faculty. Marshall says they redesigned a health care plan which does include paying more for premiums and deductibles, but ASCUF has refused to go along with the changes. Marshall says without collective bargaining, tuition for students could be impacted, as he says tuition makes up 70 percent of the operating budget. We want a fair settlement. We want to treat our outstanding faculty fairly, um, but we have to also consider uh, where we are financially, where our universities are financially. Uh, obviously, it would impact the students, it would impact the faculty, uh, the entire university would be impacted. And happening now until Friday at noon, union faculty will be voting to authorize a strike. Ballots will be counted on Monday, and tomorrow there will be a faculty contract negotiation session to discuss health care. But for now, reporting in the studio, Samantha Potter, WENY News.